Hello my friends and welcome back. I hope you are doing great. I'm Mohsen and in this video I'm going to show you how to retrieve the images from the Firebase storage and display them in the recycler view. Uh, in the last video, uh, together we learned how to store the images into the Firebase storage just like this. Here is one of the items of the storage and here is the image that we stored in the storage and this is the image url that we saved in the real-time database firebase real-time database at the same time and now uh, out of this image url we will uh, retrieve the image and display it in the recycler if you are ready hit the subscribe button give me a thumbs up and hit the bell button to be aware about the new videos and let's get started in the last video i showed you uh, each image that we are storing in the storage just like this has this address which is the url and we are saving this address here into the real-time database and if uh, i select it i can achieve this image so in this video i'm going to show you uh, how to use picasso library to load this url on an image view okay for this let's go to the android studio here in the build.gradle uh, we have to add the picasso library dependencies uh, i have separated the parts of the dependencies uh, if you want to go to my github and uh, have access to this uh, source code uh, you can easily find each dependency i'm going to copy the picasso dependency as and paste it here okay and after that we need to sync the project okay the next step is to uh, change the layout of the recycler view uh, right now the layout is like that we have only one name one phone number and the id and uh, i want to shift these items here in the right side and store the image here so i need an image view here i'm going to do the changes then i will come back to you okay here is the layout of uh, the item row and i have added this image view if you want you can copy the code and i'm going to slowly scroll it feel free to pause the video and copy the code and as always you have access to the source code uh, through my github page link down below in the description okay uh, now let's go to the recycler view adapter uh, i have stored it here into the adapter package and uh, let me explain uh, this for you uh, i hope you watched the previous series uh, link down below in the description and also here uh, we passed uh, array list and array list uh, of the class uh, contacts uh, in the constructor of the uh, recycler view adapter class and here in the function overrided function on bind view holder uh, we have created this uh, variable uh, and uh, we passed uh, the position into the uh, array list and now here are the items of the each row i have the name the phone number and the id and here text view name text view phone number and text view id and uh, we extracted uh, the data through this variable and display them here now we have to do the same for the uh, image view here in the class contact uh, we have one more item image uri and i think it should be url it's not uri it's url but that's just a name no matter so here I have to write Picasso 
dot get dot load and uh, the url we need here so current item dot image url and then dot into and here i should mention the id of the image view so img item okay that's ready and uh, we can check it on the emulator okay uh, these two items doesn't have any image and this item has the image so here we have the blank image view and here we have the image and you see that we have this image here let me add another item uh, here name random number pick image uh, let's go to the gallery here this yellow image selected and send later we got source message image is stored and then the data is stored and i'm pressing back here i have subscribe please and uh, the image and it's just like that uh, the next thing that uh, we are going to do is uh, to handle the click event listener here when i'm clicking on the item to update the data i have uh, only the name and the phone number uh, so in the next video i'm going to show you how to bring the image here in a image view and uh, you will be able to change this image and uh, store the new image in the uh, firebase real-time database and firebase storage at the same time thank you very much for your support uh, please if you haven't subscribed the channel hit the subscribe button right now uh, to be aware about the new videos and uh, if you have any question any suggestion uh, write down below in the comment box and give me a thumbs up thank you very much have a good time bye bye